like you ever felt. Are you listening? Damn. Well, it's your man, Pat Caesar, Caesar LLC, mobile mechanic and roadside services. See, I got them shirts hooked up by my t-shirt lady. I'm going to send a link down to her website below. Really good prices. So, uh, I'm out here right now, man. I'm at the auction. And, uh, just checking out, see what we got going on. I've already done got my, uh, my bidder's badge. This is an open one to make a, a video show you guys how to do this and give some ins and outs on tips tricks of the trade what to look for looking in this Corolla oh cigarettes five hour energy oh, I don't know what's up with that but um yeah I'm gonna get back to y'all your man out here I'm getting it in gonna see what's going on and then he left 30 Packs of cigarettes just chilling in the car. Right. Once I run through all this whole uh, place, I'll uh, click back in so you guys can right, get an idea of what's going on, how it works, and uh, what you have to do. It's gonna get to a point you're gonna be out here and it's gonna get super hot. Yeah, you see, I'm in my my, my dry sweat. Uh, and I got a hat and I'll probably go get my glasses and switch the hat for a uh, sombrero But so let's say you at the auction and you checking out a car like this one for instance. This is a, it's a What's this a 02 Pontiac Solstice? I ain't been on this thing either, but it's hot. So I'm chilling here for a minute. Sounds good Sounds good. So let's say you want to actually get the car what you want to do as one of the first requirements, I'm gonna do this after this family gets out of the way, uh, is check to make sure the car can go on and go crank up. And make sure the car can crank up. Because a lot of times uh, they can't, you have to go get you a, um, a jump box. They're usually provided, I bring all my own tools, and, you know, I am a mechanic. But you wanna make sure it goes into gear. See, like these people driving it right there, I'm doing the same as that thing. Go into gear, just move forward a little bit. Make sure it can actually move. And go into reverse. Yep. That's all that you want to do. You want to make sure that the car can actually move because you'll get you'll be surprised how many cars come out here. Oh boy. I can't get nothing like this. Well, this thing, thing is tiny. Tiny. Jesus Christ, man. And I ain't like the biggest person. I am only like five, six, five, seven. Oh, uh, but either way. Uh, make sure it goes in the gear. You want to pop the hoods. Look at this Civic now. Oh, they oh, treated it so bad. Mm -mm, what that smell? What a stinking booty smell. Jesus Christ. I popped the hood <laughs> and the bumper. The bumper started to come off. It's obviously been in a front end collision. So that's the type of things that you want to be looking for. Uh, no, ma'am. No, ma'am. But here's my car just in case. <laughs> No, it never did. Yeah, it never. I know. Somebody probably messed with it, to be honest with you. <laughs> yeah, because it, it's, it's a Toyota. Toyota's left forever. So, um, you can't see it here, but this thing's been in a front-end collision. Uh, I can tell just by looking at it. It's just harder to tell from a video perspective. These are pretty good motors. Uh, this is like the, uh, I think it's the EP. Uh, that transmission, they had a lot of problems with these particular year transmissions, but the motors are pretty solid. You can't really see it from there, but that's another thing that you want to check. Make sure it runs, you know, you would, for instance, let me do this, let me do this the right way. I'm gonna pop the hood. Oh, where we at? Pop the hood, boom. Let's go ahead. And this is a public auction, so you got to remember that people are going to be out here. Boom, where you at? Uh, peace, he's all, baby. All right, so let's go start this thing. Man, it stinks in here bad. We're just listening for anything. How this thing sound? Now you can't pop the hood, or you can't rev it up from here because it has an electronic throttle body. Uh, so you can't, it doesn't have like the old, it's a drive-by wire instead of drive-by, um, a fly-by wire, oh man, oh man, fly-by signal, fly-by wire. And I'll explain that in another video if it's requested. But you want to listen to high sounds, any ticking valves, like I hear that sound. 
I'm sure that that's power steering pump. I ain't even got to turn the wheel. I just, I just know because I've been dealt with it so many times. Let's see. Yep. Look how hard that wheel is. You can't see how hard it is, but it's like cutting and jerking and all types of stuff. So those are the main main ways that you want to check the car engine transmission those are the two things and then how it looks now like i said being that this is a public auction like this car i hate nissan hey nissan is on my list of not likable cars just like fords are but you'll see the cleaner it is the more it's gonna go for people are gonna ask they're gonna ask a pretty penny all right you know you got dealers fees you got sales state tax you got the the owner of this is more than likely a dealership or something who couldn't push it uh, and then they're gonna ask their fees it's a magnum hate these things too man i would probably be like bro he don't like no cars no nah, man i like toyota honda <laughs> if you got me giving me a toyota or honda i'm all right chevy truck yeah dodge truck for sure if it's diesel um i go into it well i'm gonna keep on going and looking at these cars and this does not start no 22s today not today <sighs> we'll come back to it